What is going on YouTube? I'm Valentino with Next Gen Speed and today we have a video for you guys about the 2019 Camaro that just been released this morning. Now some of you guys will be happy, some will be sad, but I'll tell you guys all about it and how it's gonna look. You can see a brand new front end design with a new bumper, grill, and headlights and stuff like that. And in the back, you'll see a brand new taillight design with a new dual taillight design that kind of goes back to the 5th gen, which is kind of stupid in my opinion. In the interior, there's nothing much different at all besides a new infotainment center. Now with the front end on this new Camaro, you see a brand new headlight design with a new grill and badge setup. Now if you ever watch Transformers, which most of you probably have, this car kind of looks like Bumblebee from the Transformers, but they kind of just screwed it up trying to follow that and kind of just packed it all together and kind of just threw it on there because they could have made it look way better, way more aerodynamic and just kind of flow with the car. The 6th Gen Camaro looked aggressive, looked awesome, aerodynamic and everything, but this car kind of just threw that off and just like, what are you guys doing with that? I feel like they could have done a way better job with that. Like you guys came so far from the 5th Gen to the 6th Gen making an amazing car and now you guys are trying to just going back to it for some reason, but... I don't know, that's what they want to do. But if you guys take a look at the bow ties, you can now see they're integrated into the bumper instead of into the front grille, besides the turbo models and the uh, six cylinder model. And the headlights are pretty much the same, besides being a little bit longer. And the headlight LEDs are now more larger and follow the hood. That kind of makes them almost go all the way across the car. Now onto the back of the car, you can see a new taillight design that includes the dual taillight design, kind of like the fifth gen, which has like two different taillights in one. And with these taillights, the LT and LS models will be coming with the regular red taillights, which the V6, SS, and Z1 will be coming with the dark tinted taillights, which will be pretty sweet. But in all honesty, in my opinion, the 6th gen taillights on the 2016 to 18 Camaro look way better, are way more killer compared to these ones. They kind of match the Corvette, kind of clear and like black look. And I'm just really happy I got my 6th gen. And last but not least on the exterior on these cars, between all models, you expect some brand new rim design, which will include these five spoke diagonal rims you see on the SS, but more will be expected to release soon. So expect some updates on that. And on the interior, the only thing new on this one will be the infotainment center screen. All of the Camaros across all trims will include a seven inch screen, which will be touchscreen including all the goodies. And there'll be an eight inch touchscreen, which will be an extra option. Now moving out of the exterior and into the car, we're going under the hood. And from all these cars, from the inline four to the V6 to the SS to the Z01, for now they have the same power as before. But if you plan on getting an SS model, the new 10 speed will finally be offered for you guys, which is kind of sucks for me, but hopefully I'll get, I'll just get an 810 and swap it into my 2017 Camaro. We'll see. But with the same power as before, with the new 10 speed, we can expect around a 3.7 to 3.8 zero to 60, which is killer. And it will finally be killing those Mustangs like we always have been before. So Mustang GT guys, we better watch the f out. So you guys with the 2018 Mustang GT that thought you guys were all bad and everything, well, we're coming for you guys, just wait. All right, now the last thing that was introduced for the 2019 Camaro lineup is a brand new 1LE turbo model, which is basically the four cylinder model with the 1LE package that makes it beefed up and ready for the track. This car will include the suspension goodies from the SS that includes the FE3 suspension setup, which includes like stabilizer bars, stiffer ball joints, different control arms and stuff like that. And this will have Brembo's all the way around, including four pistons in the front, and single piston in the rear. With this new i4 one Ali, it'll have the new 3.27 differential. This will include launch control and a revised track mode, which will make the car way more better for the track. This car will be coming with the 20 inch rims with the SS Eagle F1 Goodyear tires with 275s in the back. And as it's a one Ali model, this one will be standard with the six speed and you catch this around 30K. So stay tuned for that one coming out. And that's pretty much all we have so far about the 2019 Camaro. Let me know what you guys think though about what you guys like about it if you guys like the new design because to me i honestly don't like it at all it's pretty much stupid only thing i like is the 10 speed automatic transmission which i wish i had but but yeah please stay tuned for more please subscribe for a lot more camaro videos a lot more camaro news and a lot about other cars it's gonna be a great ass summer for a lot of car videos so can't wait to make it for you guys but yeah, i hope you guys like the video i'll catch you guys next time